morning y'all welcome back to the vlog all right it is thursday june 20 7th i believe it's the 27th today um i'm on an errand this morning so jackson and i are about to head over to my office i don't work in the summer but I got an email yesterday from my boss, from my supervisor, that where my current office is, that school needs that office for all of their daytime, daily staff. Um, that's just a hub for me. I'm not at that building every day. I do spend quite a bit of time in my office in the beginning of the year and at the end of the year. Anytime kids are testing, because I can't go into their classrooms then. Um, I'm in my office. But that's not my, um, what do I want to say? I'm not at that school. I'm not at that school every single day. There are weeks when I can be there every day. But there are weeks when I'm not. Currently, I travel. I'm trying to show y'all. Currently, I travel between three schools. And so, um... They need that space. They're very over capacity in the fact that they're building a new building onto the elementary school for fifth graders, but that building is not done yet. And so currently the fifth graders are housed in the building where my office is, but they're not a part of that. They're technically a part of the elementary school, but because they're in that building, they all now funnel into the middle school. So that school is five, six, seven, eight. Anyway, it's a complicated, it's not complicated if you're there, but anywho. So, um, what I'm doing is I'm, leave, I'm going to my office now to pack it up and move it. I don't have a lot of stuff because I just think a minimal lifestyle is better, right? So I'm going to pack everything. I have a couple totes at the office and a couple here. And I'm going to be moving to one of my other schools, which is actually closest to my house, which is a beautiful situation. Because currently I still have to drive about 15, 20 minutes to get to my office. But my other school is significantly closer to me. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. And um, so anywho, what I'm going to do is grab everything up real quick. I got a funeral to be a part of this afternoon. And so I got to come back, make sure that I'm back here by 930 at the latest is 745 right now. And um, that way I can grab a quick shower, get my hair done, find my attire, and then head over to the church a little bit early. Excuse me. So um, pack everything up. Jackson's going to help me. I have to move my computer. I have to pack up my um, printer, my office chair. Because my job is a um, state position, those funds are different. So m mostly people leave a school and leave their stuff. But I take my stuff wherever I go. And so I'm going to be sharing an office. It's a very big classroom type space with another lady, very nice lady. And so, um, because I don't have to pull students personally, it's not gonna bother me to share a space. Um, I don't think she pulls students either. I think she works with teachers, which, so um, I wanna get all that stuff done today so I can be done with it, right? Just get out of their space. It's summer cleaning. They need to do all the things. And, um, yeah, it's going to work out perfectly. I actually want it to be at the school I'm going to because it's close to the home. You know, I like I like being I don't mind traveling to my other schools. It's perfect. But if I can start my week in my week close to the home works out very good for me. Anywho, y'all, we're going to take you guys along as we go and um, pack it up and move it over. Let me see. Thank you. 
put these inside of that box so I know. Or throw it in that one. right here in this bin. Any up uh, this bin is where they go. Those. You know what? Oh, okay. I was going to say, if you need a car, I'll get you a car so you can drag everything. Oh, over. yes, ma'am. Thank you. Oh, I got to undo this desk right quick. All right. I got to undo this drawer. You have to turn the handle, the handle, not the key, the handle, take the key out. You've locked it. You've locked it, unlock it. Now take the key out. Now turn the handle. Now shove it in. Nope, push the cabinet in and turn the handle back down. The handle down. Now lock it. from here now is my computer to share that cabinet. Alrighty, you guys. So I'm at, well, the funeral is over now. We're heading to the cemetery. And um, Miss Mary, who's the lady that passed, I met her through um, her daughter, which is one of my Titus II ladies, one of the ladies in Titus II um, women. And uh, I've known Sherry for, before Titus Two Women. We've been four years. I've known Sherry for about 17 years. And so that's where I've been in this place where I live now about 17 years. So I have known um, 
Sherry that long. I have not known Miss Mary that long, but about four years. I'm in the parking lot of the church, so don't nobody worry. I'm just getting my car turned around so that when the procession is ready, I'm ready to go. Because I, I'm in a different place than where I'm normally used to being. This is not my area, so I want to make sure that I am ready when it is time to be ready. And so there it is. I'm going to go to the um, burial site, and then I have to go back to work. My boss texts me, my supervisor texts me. I need to get some tags for her. They're going to actually have my computer, my printer, my cabinet, and my chair moved. And um, I'll get a new desk over at the new school where I'm going. And I'm going to be sharing an office. It's a big classroom type thing, but it's big enough for a couple of us, three, four of us, maybe more. And that's one of the things about being transient because I go from school to school, but I'll be able to be at this school three days a week and I'll be able to be at my old school where I was two days a week. Last year, I was only there one day a week, but my schedule, that's working with students. I could be at my school all week long if it's exams or check-ins or if they don't necessarily have me scheduled to be in the classroom because of something else going on, I could be in my office. But again, the lady that I'm going to be sharing with is very nice. We do know each other um, in passing because normally when I'm at the school, I'm moving to I'm usually there two days a week and I'm usually across the hall in another classroom. So they're probably going to use that for something else. I think it's like a tutoring room. I'm only there for a certain amount of days. So they're going to just let me share with another person. Perfectly fine. I told my boss it is not a problem. I never have a problem sharing. The only issue for the very first year when I was moving to the other school was they had, I was only there on Wednesday and they had me sharing with another person who was there on Wednesday and one desk. So it was like, we can't, we both can't sit at the same desk at the same time because we're both here on the same day. So that was the only issue. But he said he would get me a desk in there. I told him I'd be happy with a table. I'm so easy. I'm easy like Sunday morning. I don't need a ton. I don't, I'm not, I have three more years and I'm on my way out. So anywho, um, I think the family is out, I think. I'm trying to see people are getting in their cars now and so we just want to make sure that we're in the um, procession um, we're in the south normally people are pretty um, mindful of funeral procession so I just wanted to make sure I was I was lined up with everybody like I said I am gonna go My mouth is still very, very sore from that burn. This is the worst burn I've ever had. And I think it's more irritated too because my tongue keeps pressing up against it. I mean, it's in my, you know, it's here. What can you do? But, um, okay, Barbara Ann, what is she doing? Too much. Let me move. Now I gotta move. Okay. There's nobody behind me, but this lady is coming up like she. Okay. I'm trying to stay straight so that I can just go out and join the procession when it's time to go. Okay. Anywho, I'm gonna jump back in to that and I will pick you guys up in just a little bit when I'm either back at my office because she wants me to take pictures of the asset tags and then send pictures of what's moving. And I'm gonna do that. Anywho, um, yeah, having some coffee. First cup of the day. I'm just kind of working on it a little bit. And it's been still warm. I've had it in my cup for a while. I'm just trying to look and see what's happening. Okay, pick you guys back up.
All right, you guys, so I'm back from all the things I had to do today. Still have some stuff I got to do tomorrow, but it can wait. I, I, I can wait until tomorrow to get it done. Um, I went to Lowe's Foods and bought some things. This is $52.30 some cents of groceries. I did use a couple of my coupons. A couple did not work, but I'll have to just look a little closer for the next time. So I got corn. They were eight for $2. Of course, it's coming up on 4th of July weekend. Corn's on sale. Cheese was $2.50. Now, here's one of the deals that didn't work. Um, I went to the deli and I got deli meat, $5.99 a pound. The coupon was for 30% off, but it had to be the Smokehouse brand of meat, which I didn't see that brand at all. I thought it was just from the Smokehouse deli. No problem. That was It was fine. The other one that didn't work, it said for breadsticks from Breadcrumb, which is their bread section. So we got a baguette thinking it was this, it was bread. It was an actual breadstick. No worries. For Sunday, we're having a thing at church. And what I think we can do is take this, which is about two feet long, maybe a little bit longer. And we can make a sandwich because we have some sliced cheese in the fridge. So we can make a deli sandwich and just cut it. And that'll be our contribution for Sunday after church picnic. We also got the rotisserie chicken. It was $8.99, half off, for, so $4.50. That one did work. Picked up two things of chips. This is for Sunday. We're having a church picnic thing. Um, yeah. So the $10 off of $50, I'm going to say to pay for this because that was like $10 together. Two things of broccoli. That's for me to eat. Sour cream, that's for the corn salsa that I'm going to make. Picked up some milk, that's for me as well. Picked up some biscuits. So in addition to what we're bringing for us to eat, we're going to share the corn dip. And then we're going to take these biscuits. Jackson didn't feel like making biscuits. I'm going to be out of town and then coming back and we're going later. So we just got these brand biscuits, buttermilk, 20 of them. And we're going to put these. This is air fryer ready. We may try that in the air fryer. And then we're going to put um, take some jam that we've made. We did some monkey butter. We have a uh, strawberry lemonade jam. We always have the mixed berry. We have a, straw a, a blueberry peach. So I think we're going to take two or three different jams with the biscuits. And that's going to be our, again, contribution to the corn dip. And then, of course, the sandwich. Picked up some butter and some uh, purpose flour for Jackson. Picked up a thing of water for me. And then some mild chilies. Oh, and some jalapenos. That's for the corn dip as well. So these three things right here are for the corn dip. That's also going with the chips. And then, um, so that was $52. My budget was $50. So $52 and there that is. Alrighty, y'all. I'm going to call it a vlog here. Um, I went to the funeral. Did all the things that I was supposed to do. Very happy to be able to go and serve my friend that way. Um, to celebrate her mom. She is one of my tightest two ladies. Um, I'm actually going to get me some lunch together because, well, it's after three now and I'm hungry. I did go back over to school really quickly to um, get the last of the things that I needed to get. Um, the They will have put a request in for um, the rest of the big stuff that needs to be moved to be moved. And again, the principal at the school said he would get me a desk in the office. So it's perfectly very good. I am going to get myself something to eat because I have not eaten anything today except just a little bit of watermelon. And um, I'm gonna go do some editing because I'm behind in videos. I know you all think, Shakima, you said you was gonna be doing videos. Y'all been traveling and doing all the things and I just have not been here. So far for the month of July, I only have one thing which is um, pastor's conference, and it's gonna be perfect, right? So, and that's at the end of the month, so. But now, I'm gonna just focus on getting done what I can get done, and yeah, there that is. So thank you guys so much for stopping by. If you liked the video, don't forget to subscribe, and we'll see you guys next time. Bye now.